In this video I'll be using PowerShell snippets to hide Microsoft Copilot from the taskbar. In Windows 11 I'm starting this video from my GitHub page and that's because there are a few bits of information here that I will be using for this video. Now I will leave the URL in the description down below. And here you can see all the snippets that I will be using in this video. The first one is for a single user. This will hide the copilot from the user that is executing the snippet. And the second snippet is to hide copilot from all the users in the computer, even the ones that you will be creating in the future. And the first snippet that I have here that hides copilot from a single user that is executing the snippet works by modifying a single registry entry in Windows registry. And now to demonstrate how this snippet works, I will just click on the button right here to copy the snippet. Then I will go to my Vember workstation where I have this Windows 11 virtual machine. And as you can see here we have Copilot in the taskbar. Now to execute the snippet I will go to my start menu, I will search for PowerShell. And we can run it without administrative privileges in this case. Insert the snippet, press enter, the snippet executed successfully. And as you can see in almost instantly the Copilot icon from the taskbar disappeared. And that's basically it for the first snippet. Now, like I said, this snippet works only for the single user that is executing this PowerShell snippet. For example, let's open a CMD window, run it as administrator, and let's create another user account. So I'll just use net user commands to create a user John, and then let's add add. And the user was successfully created, and now let's see what's ha what will going to happen when I will sign into John's account from my admin user. So let's go to John. And let's wait for his profile to be created. And the user profile was successfully created. And here in the taskbar, we can see that this user has the copilot enabled. So that makes the first snippet not that ideal if your environment has computers that are used by multiple users. So let's go back to the admin user. And then let's for now close every window in here and go back to the GitHub page. Because here I have a second snippet. In this case, this snippet will configure active setup to execute basically the same action right here. But in this case, because we are using active setup, this command will be executed for each user on the computer once during the sign-in process. And this will work not only for existing users, but for the users that you will be creating in the future. And if you want to know more about how Active Setup works, you can check out the videos that I have here. And now to demonstrate this snippet, once again I will click on the button right here to copy the snippet. Go back to my virtual machine, and this time, because I will be making system-wide changes, by modifying active setup, we need to run PowerShell with administrative privileges. So let's go to the start menu, search for PowerShell and run it as administrator. Let's click yes here and insert the snippet. Let's press enter. The snippet was executed successfully. And now let's create another user account. So let's once again, let's use net user commands. Let's create Bob and let's add add. So we have three users on the computer right now. John, Bob, and also my admin user that is executing the commands. So first let's go to the John's account. And as you can see, no longer John has the copilot icon on the taskbar, but this was already existing user on the computer. And now let's check out Bob's account. Let's select Bob and click on sign in. And once again, the account profile was successfully created on this computer, but this time we no longer see the copilot icon in the taskbar. And that's because active setup was executed during the profile creation and it removed the icon from the taskbar. And that's basically it for this video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and see you in the next one.